Welcome in everybody. I'm Liminal Shift. Today I've got something new for our channel. Yesterday was the release of English OP07, 500 Years in the Future. Uh, I did go to uh, some local stores and found absolutely nothing on the shelves, but uh, luckily I did have some boxes pre-ordered. Um, I was able to find one thing at MSRP. Uh, Walmart actually had uh, the double packs, uh, DPO4, yes, DPO4, which has OPO7 packs in it. Um, they didn't have the double pack sets out during the first few, you know, sets of uh, regular sets of uh, one piece. So um, they started those, you know, four sets ago. I guess it would have been uh, the first one would have been for OPO4, right? Four, five, six, seven. Yes. So, uh, yeah, I have already opened one box of this. It was uh, on an online rip and ship. Shout out to Captain Rafa, R-A-F-A. Uh, that first box, uh, the first pull from it wasn't that great. It was a secret rare. Uh, and you know, we're going to get plenty of secret rares. Um, there's not that many uh, out there to pull. And, you know, there, there's a good number of them in the boxes. So, um, but what I did pull in my first box, making it an extra special box, even, even with just two hits, I managed to pull the Trafalgar D-Law Treasure Rare out of my first box of OPO7. So that was really cool to see. All right, Liminal, are you ready for your booster box, bro? All right, here we go, Liminal. Best of luck, bro. Number nine, baby. All right, let's see, uh, let's see how One Piece treats you, bro. Get this bad boy opened. Here we go. Ooh, starting off strong. Let me know. Let's see what you pull. Best of luck, bro. She's very. Um. Ooh, is that a leader? No. F oh, way. Furanki. Oh, it's Sabo, dude. I thought it was a leader. Sabo Seeker Rare. So you got a Seeker Rare. Hopefully this is not just a Seeker Rare box. Up and it's Luffy going gear second. Oh man, I like it. I like Ors. Was that Ors Jr. or was that just Ors? Ors Jr. was the one in, uh, I think this is an alternate art. Ors Jr. was the one in uh, Whitebeard, uh, the war. The one with the hat. All right, Liminal, best of luck, bro. I, I, I hope you get an SP here. Margureto. I think it is. Oh, it's law. Oh, sh oh Hold on, is that the expensive law? It's the treasure rare. Oh! <laughs> oh, I knew I've seen this artwork somewhere. Treasure rare pool. Let's go to Rafa Regard D Law. Um, I think it was like the seventh or eighth best card in the set. There's definitely better ones in here that you can pull. The manga card itself is Boa Hancock. Uh, then Boa also has a alt leader as well as an alternate art card. Both of those look great. Uh, I, I would say my my main chases are going to be the Boa cards. Uh, there are some jewelry jewelry Bonnie cards in here that are really nice as well. Uh, alt leader and alt art uh, for her as well. And then uh, I would say right after the manga for me though, the Nami and o Otama uh, SP is just. I think my favorite One Piece card uh, ever, aside from maybe Gear 5 manga or the Oda signature card or the Boa manga card. Um, as far as SPs or and below go, that Nami and Otama uh, SP is just beautiful. It has fireworks in the sky. It's a, a kind of a, it's in Land of Wano, but it's a Japanese-esque festival uh, environment on the card. And it's just beautiful. So uh, hopefully we'll get to see that. Uh, I am going to fast forward through, of course, uh, opening up these packs with a pair of scissors because the English packs are tough to open. Let me go ahead and get the booster box open, though. Okay. And as always, I will try to keep left on left, right on right. For those of you that keep track, uh, they will end up in reverse order though. 
Top is on bottom, bottom is on top because I do restack them as I open them with scissors. So let's get the left side out here. Oh, sorry for the little earthquake there. All right, got left side, right side. Just prop the box up in the background for a little atmosphere. And for luck, right in front of uh, Luffy's Devil Fruit there. And yeah, well, as I cut them, I'll, uh, I'll stack them well. So let me uh, fast forward through this boring stuff and we get to it. All right, and that'll do it. Let's go ahead and start out with our first pack. Again, this is left sides on left, right's on right. This is actually the bottom pack on the left side, but it's on top now. Same as over here, it's gonna be reversed order uh, due to cutting open the packs. So I mentioned uh, last night in my first box, I opened up the, uh, I pulled the Treasure Rare Trafalgar D Law. Uh, my, my favorite captain. Uh, also, I guess if I had, were to ever get a Devil Fruit power, I would probably want Laws. Um, the uh, operating room is really just cool to have that much control over the stuff around you, plus, you know, flight, you know, and other stuff. So uh, lots of good powers there, uh, short range teleportation. Um, so good stuff. Um, Trafalgar D Law is actually the second treasure rare we've gotten in English. Uh, remember, these are the treasure rares are a, kind of a new card or new type of card that is region specific. Uh, so the ones we get in English, they will not get over in Japan. They won't get in China, etc. So uh, OP07 has Trafalgar D Law. OP06 had uh, kind of a Western art style Nami in it. Uh, it kind of reminds me of the reminded me of the art of J. Scott Campbell, the comic book artist. Um, and uh, let's see, China has had a the first one was a Nami, um, and recently they put out a. Uh, Oh, uh, what was it? Um, it was a Boa Hancock uh, that I actually got to import both of those uh, when they came out. Uh, at some point, I'll show you, you know, what I've got graded and what's going out to get graded. Uh, those are in there. Japan has also had a Nami. And I want to say they have had a second one, but I, I kind of forget what it is. Uh, maybe it was uh, Yamato or... I don't know. I'll, I'll have to look into that and... Uh, Hopefully it hadn't come out already. Maybe I didn't get it. We'll see. But anyway, uh, let's. Uh, this is our first time opening up OPO7 on the channel, so we're going to slow roll it, kind of, uh, at least through the uh, first stack of packs. Uh, if we start hitting, hitting a lot of dupes, I'll go a little faster um, after that. So, all right, let's get it into 500 years in the future, OPO7. We got Steri, Capote, or Capote, Vega Force 1, Edward Weevil, faux beard. Aladdin. Tony Tony Chopper, looking cute as heck. Boa Sandersonia. Shave. Salome. Or is it Salome? It's Salome. Boa Hancock, regular leader, which means we'll just get two regular hollows in this one. We've got Baccarat and Porcus D. Ace. Uh, I will be sleeving up regular hollows, hollows later, but super rares and above get sleeved immediately. Got to protect the hits. All right, Porchamy, Baskerville, Maha, Usopp. Iron Body, Snake Dance, Koala, Gina, Hattori, the Putrid Pigeon, still with just a lot of drip, <laughs> him and his owner, Vega Punk Leader, Blaze Slice, and Marguerite. As our hollows. In English, you do get two hollows per pack and at least two hits per box with uh, you know additional chances of getting a third and uh, is it potentially fourth hit? I think I've seen that before, but it could be wrong. Edison, Tonjit, 
Jinbei, York, Sedersonia again, Khalifa, Slow Slow Beam Sword, Slave Arrow, Dragon Breath. Nico Robin, Galaxy Wink, and there's our first super rare with Lilith, another one of the Vegapunks. I did actually record another video before this one, um, and <laughs> Getting this, I, I literally got this an hour ago on my front porch, so uh, this video kind of bumped that one. So uh, when you watch the next video, don't think you went through a time loop or something. I, I, I mentioned OP07, I'm about to get my boxes, etc. Uh, I decided to put this one out first because everybody wants the new stuff first, right? I would. There's, isn't it supposed to be Papa Goo? But okay. I, I guess the U's mostly silent, so... Gecko Moria, Scratch Minapu, Bucken, Morgans, Karmic Punishment, Requazar Help, <laughs> Atlas, another one of the Vegapunks, Captain John, Gecko Moria, There's our zombie Luffy, and behind him is another super rare coming out with Jinbei. About to throw down some Fishman Karate on somebody. I hope y'all have uh, all been doing well in the, uh, this hot, hot summer. Uh, I've already had enough of the heat, but we've got plenty to go. So, Blue Jam. Gizmonda, Dagara and Magara, Maha, Maha, I found you, okay, no, Dracula Mihawk, Pickles, what's your deal, Pickles, oh, <clears throat> I, I do apologize for that one, that was, that was pretty bad, <laughs> Aladdin, Korobu, Moda, Monkey D. Luffy, and I uh, love that art, little action lines everywhere, a little blur, Kaku, regular hollow, and Outlook the Third, regular hollow. So nothing to phone home about yet. Reiju, Usopp. Tonjit, D&M, Island of Women, Megaton, Nine Tails Rush, Pickles, Iron Bodhi, yeah, yeah, I said that like that was a name, Iron Body, <laughs> Okay, y'all are y'all y'all know what Iron Body is. Uh, Iron Body, oh my god. Hamburg. I might be uh, you know, I, I didn't do a video for like two or three weeks, and that's my bad. Just real life's been busy, etc. Um had to take a break. First first big break I've taken since I started the channel in, in January, and yeah, just missing that much just th <laughs> throws you off a bit from what you're used to. Uh he possesses the world's most brilliant mind. Kuma is besties with Vegapunk. Lushi, but not uh, Luffy Lushi, but other Lushi. And then we have Rob Lucci as our other regular hollow in that pack. All right, over halfway done on the left side. Got us some faux beard, blue jam, Monda, the party fish. Cor uh, Korobu, Khalifa, Aladdin, 
Dice, Salome, Itomi, Itomi Mizu, Caribou, Fisher Tiger, regular hollow, and there's another super rare behind him in Porsche from the Foxy Gang. Capote, Fusa, Apu, Jinbei, Quasar Help, Spandam, Egghead, Atlas, she's an awesome Vegapunk, Slow Slow Beam, or I should say they are an awesome Vegapunk. Rob Lucci, regular leader, which means we just have two regular alt, uh, or not alts, regular hollows in this pack. Demonic Aura, Nine Sword Style, Osura Demon, Nine Flash. And Porcus de Ace. <laughs> that was a mouthful. So again, out of uh, this set, really, really want all the Boas, want all the Jewelry Bonnies, definitely want that Nami SP. Uh, definitely want that manga. Uh, you, you know, I don't have a manga and I want one really bad. Um, aside from the gear five manga and, and, you know, the Oda signature card from OPO five, I'd have to say this Boa, uh, Boa Hancock manga is, is, uh, my third most sought after card in, uh, in one piece. There's Manda, Steri, Capote, Usopp, Snake Dance, Keep Out, Pickles, Corabu, Gloriosa, Sister to Furiosa, I don't know, maybe, Big Bun, Kaku, regular hollow, what you hiding, giraffe boy, ah, uh, back rot, that's all right. Red? No. No, it's not. Just checking. Faubeard. Tonjit. Jinbei. Apu. Nine Tails Rush. Khalifa. Karmic Punishment. Gina. How you doing, Gina? I like Gina. Ptolemy. Shaka. Frankie. And Frankie doesn't have anything for us. Just Outlook the Third. Boo. Boo, Outlook the Third. Yeah, Sabo's whole family sucks. Papag. And I guess I'm going to have to get used to saying that. That's weird. Blue Jam. Fusa. Edison. Another one of the Vegapunks. Sanji. Dice, Dracula Mihawk, Shave, Doflamingo, eh, another regular leader, Jewelry Bonnie, taking up all my hits. <laughs> Guess they're all going to be on the right side. We got Otama and Galaxy Wink. Red, nope, okay. DNM, Bucking, Porchamy, Vegapunk York, Iron Body, Aladdin, Egghead Island, Captain John, Moda, that's a new one for us. There's another, Pythagoras, or Pythagoras, another one of the uh, Vegapunks. Porcus D. Ace. Hello. And oh my god, there it is. There is the Onami Anotama SP. One of the biggest hits in this set that I've wanted. This is the second biggest hit. hit. 
Um, I'm pretty sure it's $150 plus dollars as of when I checked last night. Uh, the set just came out though, so who knows what's going to happen to this card. But oh my god, look at how beautiful that card is. Look at the lanterns up there, the fireworks. They're both celebrating. Awesome clothes. Just just the, the epitome of having fun at a Japanese festival or Land of Wano festival. Uh, very important festival for them. Um, if you've if you've watched the Land of Wano story arc, and oh my God, I can't believe I pulled this on my second box. Oh, that makes me so happy. Uh, I missed this in the case that was open last night, but again, can't complain because I got that treasure rare Trafalgar D Law, and now I have the Onami SP. It is beautiful. Oh my God, look at that card. Just the colors, the the fun. The, oh man. That is definitely going to go get graded. So uh, I'm just going to have to try for a Beckett Black Label at first. And if that fails, we'll go PSA. But I'm so happy to see this card. Let's go ahead and carefully uh, put it into a top loader as well. And as you can tell, <laughs> I'm kind of sweating already. My, uh, my fingers are steaming up the top loader, which isn't that great for the card. But at least it's in a sleeve. So... <laughs> All right, cool down, hands. Cool down. Too much heat. Okay, okay. All right, we can do this. Now, since this box had an SP in it, I mean, th we definitely have one more hit. Um, <laughs> let's just keep going and see what we get. Uh, I'm, I'm eventually going to have to get a face cam because I, I have a genuinely huge grin on right now that I would love to share with the world. That card is just amazing. I'm so happy I pulled it. All right, let's go with Fusa, Monda, Jinbei, Island of Women, Megaton Nine Tails Rush, Egghead Island, Tony Tony Chopper, Crocodile, Sabus. More pizza, what everybody needs and wants. Mr. Tanaka, and uh, I should point this out while this is uh, while this is up on the screen. Um, for some reason, even though they kind of Bandai came out with a, a press release back when OPO Seven Japanese was being released, they apologized for a couple of error cards, which to this point they haven't fixed in the Japanese reprints of it yet so far. And I thought for sure by the time it came out in English, they would have fixed it, but they have not. So um, it's probably not going to matter that it's an error card if they're not going to put out a, a fixed one. Because, you know, when they do, whichever one is rarer is normally valued more, whether it's the error card or the fixed card. And I got to say, this is still error. Uh, the color is not supposed to be around that bow. Uh, it's just supposed to be cut off like the other bows. So, I mean, it's not a huge error, but you, you think they... I don't know their, their printing schedules and stuff, but you think they would have fixed it for the English release since it was out months later. But who knows? And there we go with the second hit of the box. It is a secret rare Sabo, which, uh, you know, I unfortunately pulled last night. So two boxes and already doubling up on the secret rares, but that's no nothing new to us all here on this channel. Um, we'll go ahead and take it. Nothing wrong with at least one dupe. Although I'm going to have like a dozen of these by the time I'm done, I'm sure. And that uh, that could be it for the guarantees in this box, maybe. I don't know. But we could get a third card. We did get that extra spicy SP, so there is a good chance, I think, that we get a third hit. I'm not sure if that's guaranteed, though. Once you get an SP or alt leader pool, Gizmonda. Edison, Vega Force One, and how crazy would it be to get the top two hits in the set in one box? We already have the Onami SP. Can we see the Boa Hancock manga card? Keep out. Spandom. Sanji. Gloriosa. The most brilliant mind. And it's not Kuma. It's who he's talking to. Doflamingo, although Kuma's awesome. 
especially if you've seen his backstory. Karina, and another regular hollow with demonic... Okay, I'm just going to stick to Osura Demon Nine Flash. That's a long move name, but I know he needs time to focus and build up that strength before he strikes. I think I did see a super rare at the back of this pack. We have Gecko Moria, Papag, Papa, oh, Papa G. Maybe that's how you should say that. Maha, Sanji, Slow Slow Beam Sword, Koala as a kid, Dice, Rowanora Zoro. Don't think we've seen that one in this box yet. Shaka, another one of the Vegapunks. It Itomi Mizu. It's the uh, Foxy's announcer, right? Tony Tony Chopper. Hollow. And there is the Super Rare I peaked with a Stussy. Or st a Stussy. One of those. And for a Super Rare, that's looking... That's looking pretty awesome. I like the uh, POV and the, the whole wind swooping up the coat. Mixing up those cherry blossom petals in the wind there. Pretty good. All right, we got the Demon Child. Gizmonda. Bucken. York. York might be my favorite Vegapunk. Snake Dance. Tony Tony Chopper. Dracula Mihawk. Mass Deuce. Nico Robin. Crocodile. Urouge. And another super rare. This time it's Monkey D. Dragon. Luffy's daddy. And yeah, he's been an absent dad, but you know, he's uh, he's had stuff going on. Trying to, trying to change the world. Does that excuse it? Probably not, but... In that type of world, <laughs> don't have much choice sometimes. Baskerville. Vega Force One. Jinbei. Island of Women. Boa Sandersonia. Morgans. The controller of news. Um, I'll get that card later. <laughs> Gecko Moria kind of went wonky, fell off the stack. More pizza. Jewelry Bonnie going hog, and ham <laughs> on the pizza. Uh, Foxy regular leader. There's Curly, the Dan, the uh, sort of adoptive mother of Luffy. And there's a Monkey D. Luffy Hollow, and behind him is our alternate Art Don. This one is going to be from the uh, former Warlords. Got Boa, Mihawk, Doflamingo, Kuma, Gecko Moria. Uh, missing one or two there, but all Warlords except for the Navy guy there, who's probably peeing his pants a little bit. Trying to explain something to the warlords and they ain't even looking at him. Alright, Reju, Porchimi, Marigold, Island of Women, Karmic Punishment, Koala, Keep Out, Dragon Breath, Monkey D. Luffy, Hatori Hollow, There's something behind there. Okay. Aim hollow. And yeah, we do get a triple hit box. We have the alternate art Foxy. So not only did we get the second best hit in the box, we got a bonus hit, extra spicy box. Not at all bad for the second box uh, I've opened.
Very happy with that. Now, at this point, I, I have absolutely no idea if we can still see a manga or something else, but we do have uh, six packs left, so let's just cut through them, see what we got. Moria, Jinbei, Bucken, Blue Jam, Spandam, Koala, Help, Morgans, Zoro, Joseph, Different Tony Tony Chopper, Hollow, and Uruj, Hollow. Looks like we got a regular leader in this one. So let's just uh, actually skip. There's a couple of new ones in there. Okay. Monkey D. Dragon, regular leader. Marguerite, which we've seen, Hollow, and Tempest Kick, Hollow. Four more. And we have our second alt art done in this pack. Stary, Faux Beard, Monda, the Party Shark, Requays Our Help, Karmic Punishment, Snake Dance, Hatori, Zoro, there's our regular leader, Boa Hancock, Rob Lucci, Hollow. We're going to claim the One Piece, Hollow. And the second alt art Don. All right, three packs remain. What a box. OPO 7s treat me well so far. I don't want to jinx it because I definitely do get jinxed uh, quite a bit, but. Uh, yeah, OP, OPO 7 has been nice to me. First two boxes. Very nice. Okay, Egghead. Dracul Mihawk. Sanji Vinsmoke. Gecko Moria. Zoro in his Egghead outfit. Gloriosa. Trafalgar Law Hollow. And there is a super rare Boa Hancock in... Jeez, look at the art on that. They uh, they definitely target certain uh, certain demographics with these card arts. They they know who their audience is for sure. Then again, Bo is supposed to be the the prettiest woman in the world in the One Piece uh, in the One Piece zeitgeist. So that's really cool. Uh, we I mean we've hit two cards of hers uh regular hollow as well well the regular leader and then uh this super rare but again she has an awesome alt art an alt leader as well and then she is the star of the show with the manga this time and all those cards look great i think the alt leader is probably my favorite though uh and the manga you know it itself of course is is amazing so uh gizmonda usopp jinbei Capote, Dice, York, Megaton Nine Tails Rush, Atlas, Gina, Gina the Giant, Mass Deuce, Monkey D. Luffy, and another super rare, this time with Basil Hawkins. Hey, see, Rafa, I told you I'd pull more. <laughs> so don't worry about that other one. You can sell that to your buddy. I have a feeling I'll be getting a few of those. <laughs> Tonjit. Vega Force One. Last Pack Magic. Papa G. Baskerville. Spandam. Khalifa, Island of Women, and you know Kuma was smart because if he sent Sanji here instead of Luffy, we never would have seen Sanji again. I'm just saying. I mean, even if he didn't die, he wouldn't have left. I mean, there, there would have been no way to make him leave, right? So, 
He possesses the world's most brilliant mind. I was just talking about how smart Kuma is, but Kuma's talking about how smart Vegapunk is, so. Moda. There's the man of the hour with uh, Vegapunk, regular leader. But unfortunately, that means our last pack has no magic. It's just regular hollows with a Foxy and a Blaze Slice. So keep watching. I definitely have more OPO7 boxes to open. Uh, I've got one of at least three different shipments coming in. Uh, two are booster boxes and others, those uh, DP packs I managed to get on Walmart.com. Um, let's do a quick recap. We did get our two Alt Art Dons with the uh, the Warlords staring down, a again, a Navy guy whose pants at this point can't be dry. Not facing those monsters down. We do have Secret Rare Sabo. We're going to be seeing him a lot. Him and Ace. <laughs> Hopefully more Ace because Ace is more expensive or valuable, however you, however you want to say it. We do have Alt Art Foxy. He does have an Alt Leader card as well, but this is not it. And then the star of this box, this gorgeous, gorgeous Land of Wano festival card with Onami and Otama. Forgetting there were woes, no care in the world. Got cotton candy in their hands. Fireworks in the sky, dancing. Cherry blossoms everywhere. Just gorgeous, gorgeous card. I, I sincerely hope this... If I was to get any card in a black label, this this would look great in one of those slabs. So uh, keep your fingers crossed for me. Uh, I don't know when I'm going to be seeing it in, in the Beckett. Um, I will be doing PSA here pretty soon for myself once, uh, once my One Piece promo comes in from PSA. Um, and we'll see what we get. I will try to do a video showing uh, what I'm sending off. That way I can have a you know follow-up video later when we get the return and see what we get from them, okay? So anyway, stay tuned. If you hadn't checked them out, uh, I do have some new Five Nights at Freddy's sticker pack openings for in my shorts, as well as Naruto um, and some other stuff uh, I haven't opened lately. So please check those out. And until next time, enjoy your summer. Stay hydrated, people. It's It's really hot out there at least for us in the Northern Hemisphere. I, I envy those in the Southern Hemisphere right now. Uh, I'd rather be in, in cool weather than hot. But anyway, y'all take it easy and uh, see you on the next.